How's it going everyone and welcome back to another video. So in this one I'll be showing you how to get the Doom Ripper. I recently farmed this sword and I gotta say it looks really good with my set. But before we kick off the video, I just want to say this method involves using an extra account. You can use a friend, but they will be standing in place for quite a long time, so you might not want to drag them into this, because uh, it's going to be a nightmare, and they won't be able to move, and that's kind of a bad friend thing to do, so yeah, don't, don't involve them. Also, this is the same method I used to get my Soulbound Axe. I'll have a video on screen if you guys want to go check it out. Once you have a spare account, you want to take that account to this location. We'll be running this dungeon. You can use the other dungeon in this location, but I feel like this one is just a bit more better because you have two chances of getting a rare chest in the same room. And that's what we'll be farming, the rare chest, because it has a chance to drop the sword, which is a 1% chance to drop, I think. I'm not too sure on that, but it's pretty low. So the idea of this method is to be refreshing these two rooms, this one and this one, until we have a chest. If there is no chest or we have the wrong room, we simply click on our alt and click go to. This will save you so much time if you were to do it solo. Now I'll show you the location of the chests. The first room is this one. It requires you to click on the roots here and you can peep over this little area to see if there is any chests. If there isn't any chests, you wanna run back to the entrance and you will lose aggro and then you wanna click on your alt. But if you do see a chest, you wanna make your way down to the dungeon and click on the roots here by the lake and the other roots by the Sneevel camp. This will open the two entrance to the rooms. The second room is a lot easier. Once you spawn in, you will see if there's a chest straight away. If we don't see one, you wanna make your way a bit further down behind this little hill and there will be another location where the chest can spawn. This location is where I got two chests in the same room. It was pretty crazy and this is also the place where I actually got my sword. So this place means quite a lot to me. And that's it for the video. If you have any improvements, let it be known in the comments so other players can get this sword a bit faster. I hope you enjoyed, I hope you get the sword and if you do, let me know by tweeting at me. I always love seeing people get rare items. I hope you enjoyed, remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and as always, I'll see you in the next one.